What up world, I'm Brady Lynn, welcome to the channel, and say hello to Max O'Toole, an ambitious old gal, just trying to survive in the zombie apocalypse with no skills. That is right, Max is starting off with zero skills, and the challenge is to go from zero to hero in this Project Zomboid playthrough. Max, dressed in her newly tailored clothing, has survived until the morning of day seven, which is where we join her now. Okay, time for our show. As usual, we're going to sit down and read while we wait. Uh, today's a big day. Um, now that I've got the vehicle, I'm going to take it over to the warehouse area uh, where I know I can find like some nails and some other tools and who knows what else. Um, I do think I'm going to make this <laughs> very unsafe house my base for now until I find something better. Um, I do know some better houses outside of town, but they're they're far away and I want to get into town and, and do stuff. So uh, right now this is going to be it. So what I'd like to do is go to the warehouses, get some nails. Um, I already have an axe and, and other things to use, a saw. Uh, and um, so I'd like to put some planks on these windows. Or even better, if I go to the warehouse and find metal sheets and potentially a uh, welding thing. Um, I can put metal sheets on this house and make it safer. So uh, that's the plan. We're gonna head over there and find some good stuff today. I know that. Uh, we're definitely gonna run into some zombies over there too. So um, we're probably gonna get pretty exerted pretty quickly, but whatever, we'll figure it out once we get over there. Uh, we don't need to take any books with us today because we are, well, you know what? Scratch that, let's actually take it. Um, we'll put it in our bag. Uh, there's a good chance I'll get exerted and need to sit down somewhere, so... Alright, let's get our bag on. And grab these yogurts. That'll be good. Alright, let's go. Bust a move. Bust a move, baby. Oh no, it's foggy. Yes, yes, yes. we are going to the warehouses, baby. station wagon oh Jesus that scared the crap out of me I didn't see him all right we've made it to the warehouses and there are just so many zombies over here so it's gonna take a minute to clear this place out oh man wow look at all of them all right well I got a plan all right I'm just gonna park all right here Gotta hurry up. Get out. Um, <clears throat> right. <laughs> Didn't quite plan this out perfectly. Um, there is a um, fenced in area, kind of this direction. I think what I'm gonna do is get myself over there. There's also a trailer park just up the road. Um, I'm gonna end up setting myself up over here because I really wanna get in those warehouses and get the tools and stuff. So. Wow, we gotta plan this out. <laughs> We're probably gonna be over here for a few days. Um, I didn't bring a ton of food with me, but like I said, there's some trailer park. There's a trailer park just up the way. Wow, that's a lot of zombies. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pop in here. Yeah. Like this. We're gonna eat something. And I'm going to clear out this area as best I can. Yep. Clear out this area. There's a place to stay in here. If I can just get this area secure, and then I can kind of slowly secure the other areas and eventually get into the warehouse, which is the main goal. That warehouse is going to have so much good stuff, like, I can't even tell you. So, and then, of course, we got the gas station just up the street. So... As long as the power doesn't go out, we are good to go. All right, let me just take care of these zombos. Let's see, we got two over there, three. Let's try and get these guys. Come here. Come here, use. Oh, nice. All right, cool. Next. So we're gonna clear out this whole area. We can stay over here. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Come on. Oh. 
Nope. Come on, biznatch. We don't want to get too tired too quick. Just make sure there's got anything I don't want. Let's check this food vending machine. Chips. Nice. Perfect. Alright, who else wants to die? We got somebody up here. Somebody over there. Ooh, lord. Okay, let's draw these guys over. We might leave those guys alone. And try just try and get in this building. Come here. Come here. Noise. Go ahead and take that. We can disassemble later. Alright. I got this person. Right, come here. Come here, you. Yeah. Nice. Take it. Alright, maybe we can get in. Nope. Let's see if this door's open. Usually these are locked in, knocked up pretty tight. Yeah, let's try the other side. We got us a zombie here. Okay, how many we got? It's a lot. Let me try and weave my way around, hop over the fence and come around back. Okay, I almost always have good luck, and I hate saying it right now with this window being open. Almost always. So let's hope it's almost always still. Oh, not looking good. Nope. Shit. <laughs> Alright, there's other windows. There's also the- there's a house just up the way. Just across the street. Oh my god, look at that. It's pretty lucky. Alright, we just want to check here, cause... Let's see. Wonder... No, that banging is probably from a storage unit. All right, let me see if I can't take this apart. Yes. Nice. Okay, cool. All right. We'll take care of whatever zombie might be a lurking. Let's take these apart. Let's figure out where that's coming from. It's definitely coming from one of these rooms. Where's that coming from here? Come on, lady. Nice. We need to rest somewhere. Alright. There's always good stuff in here. Just need to find one. Well, these rooms will have some furniture in it. I can sleep on. There's a generator. Crowbar. Nice. We'll have to come back for all this stuff. I can sleep on one of those. What's in here? Yeah, I can sleep in here. Nice. 
Okay, that's where I'll sleep. Let's go check the rest of this place. Try not to make any noise, because there are a bunch of zombies out there. Ooh, hello. Denim strips. Take that. I'll take both of these. Cool. Aw, oh, dude. I'm going to pick up this TV, take it into that back room, and we're going to chill out there. We're going to get well rested, and then we'll take care of all these zombies in the area and slowly make our way over to the warehouse. That's the plan. Sticking with that plan, I didn't leave the room for the rest of the night. I read my books and watched Life and Living, gaining my second level in foraging. In the morning, I was able to also catch the cooking show and get a few extra points there. Now, all refreshed from a good night's sleep, let's take on those zombies and get into the warehouse. Alright, we've got our first group right. And we need to try and get these guys out of the way. So let's do it. We've got one coming over to us. If I can get another one, that's fine. Yep. Nope. <laughs> Alright, come on, dude. Take you on first. That's good, that's good, that's good. Come on. Three is just fine. Just fine and dandy. Yep. Nice. Just keep standing on the dude. Nice. So, some military boots. Put those on the ground. Again, I, I don't know if I'll ever come back to this, but I'm going to take those leather gloves. You never know. Alright, now I can just take you on just like this. What up, yo? Oh, dude. Nothing good with that purple wallet. Come on. Come on in. God, dude. Get out of here. What do we got? Okay, we've got... We got a few zombos. Come on. Come on. And that, that little bee right there I can just bust up in that door. I don't care because it's probably locked. 
Come on. What you got in your back? A little kitchen knife, maybe? Come on, construction man. Two construction mans. Menses. Oh my god, dude. Suck on it. There we go. Businessman. I can't remember if... Let me inspect these real quick. Yeah, there's a lot of pockets and shit on there. I think that's good for tailoring. Come on, dude. Meaning, um, the more the more spots you have on an object, um, the more you can tailor onto, it gives you uh, more experience. So that's what I'm thinking. Don't die. It's a bad time to die. Come on. We gotta rest. Nope. Uh-uh. Oh yeah. We are exerted. Oh my god, that's gotta- I gotta get in this car and just chill out for a minute. Girl, it was open. <laughs> Actually, let's make sure there's no more zombies on this side. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Oh, man. We're so good. And here we are. The most beautiful warehouse ever. <laughs> so much stuff in here. Let me just come over here and see if there's any food real quick. Because I don't have any food on me. Let's hope there's some chips or something in here. There's a pop. Well, I'll drink it. I might get lucky and have some food in one of these offices. Uh, let's just check... This is just going to be clothes. Yeah. Oh, what's that? I might take these coveralls. I'm telling you, like, having these, um... And then we could rip these. Yeah, those will be good for tailoring. I'm, like, for just leveling tailoring. That's all that. That's all that's worth. So, I think that's a good plan to take those. All right, yeah, we are exerted, man. All right, I'm not gonna take my chance going over there. We're just gonna have to deal with being hungry. Okay, what do we got going on in here? All right, that's what I was looking for, a box of nails. Antique oven. You see that? Antique oven, oh man. All right, come on, propane torch. There it is. Is it full? Yep. And there's a propane tank. Oh, a snap. Okay, so we'll take that propane torch. We'll get us some sheets. So much stuff here. It's hard to leave this place. <laughs> uh, we just need some sheets. I, I, th I think, how many windows do I have? Let's see, there's two. We'll take those two. We need at least... One, two, three. I think three or four. Yeah, four. So that's two. I need to come back for that propane tank. Okay, we'll take... We'll take those. Okay, <clears throat> so that covers uh, securing my house. That's really what I came over here for, but I also came over here just to really see kind of what good stuff we could find in here. Okay, there's more propane torches... Nails. I'm looking for kind of like big ticket items like a sledgehammer, pickaxe, those kind of things. 
box of screws. Let's see. Metal sheets, planks, hand axe, hammer, okay. You find everything in here. It's crazy. <laughs> crazy, crazy. It's like coming shopping. That's why I like I like coming back. I'll come back here. Oh my god, another propane torch. Um You find everything. Everything. Oh, it's so good. Oh god! You asshole. You asshole. This is not good. Holy crap. We're so weak. Damn, that was close. If there had been one more zombie beyond that door, I'd probably be restarting this playthrough right about now. Instead of heading home with the goodies I just looted, how about I have Max take a little nappy poo upstairs? Get her rested and return home early in the morning, when base defense gets taken up a notch with the handy propane torch and metal sheets. If you stuck me to the end, it means probably like the episode. Let's go into the like button. Also consider subscribing and join my crazy camp. Thank you to my new and current subscribers, and as always, until next time, bye-bye for now.